Hello guys and welcome back. As you've probably noticed, the YouTube channel has had a complete refurbishment. Um, it's now not Chalk Fitness, it is now Jordan Chalk's personal YouTube channel. So from now on you'll be hearing from me, you'll be seeing me and the people I'm training with. So firstly, I just want to apologise again for the reason that we weren't here or filming for the last month due to time restraints. We weren't be able to film constantly and I wasn't able to edit all the films. But now we've got a lot of time on our hands and we can now upload and bring you lots of more footage. So Jordan's going to be entering a competition in July. It's on the 16th of this year and it's a men's physique competition. So what I am planning to do is to bring you all the food, all the nutrition and training that I'm doing for it. This will start on Monday, which is, I believe, the 14th. Of this month so we will keep you up to date as much as possible to that here we're training with martin and harry so the first movement that we performed was the barbell bench press my aim at the moment is to basically reduce the weight and increase the reps for the next couple of weeks as i have been doing a lot of heavy work recently so it's basically just if you want to call it a deload a couple of weeks for me so here we're doing the bench press and on weight wise I've got 60 kilos here. I was performing 15 repetitions plus the after 15 we're doing three half reps and three full reps just to kind of exhaust the chest as well. Um, and this was performed for five sets. So the next movement we performed was the cable fly. It has got a range of names you can call this exercise but I stick with cable fly. It's a simple name. So here. All you've got to do is keep your arms straight. At the elbow, I have a slight flexion, which is all, it's really good for engaging the chest and being able to squeeze a lot more. So as you notice, when I bring my hands together, I open my hands up. This is the perfect opportunity to be able to engage your chest to its at maximum potential. As you can see, my hands come in, they squeeze together, and I squeeze the pectoral muscle as tight as possible for a second, and then release, and then you repeat. Again, I am doing 15 repetitions for this movement. Our third movement of the workout is the dumbbell incline bench press. As you noticed, I've gone from one pushing movement to a cable movement to another pushing movement with dumbbells. There's a prime reason for that is I don't like going from one pushing movement on um, barbell to another one, specifically like the dumbbells. So that's why I've incorporated a cable movement in, in the middle. So here again, I'm doing about, I think I've performed about 17 repetitions in this one set and we completed four sets. Again, I'm doing partial repetitions, so it's not, I'm not going all. I'm not extending the arms all the way every um, repetition. Another fantastic movement for training your pectoral muscle is the seated fly. Now, I know I've done one fly movement already. However, this is a completely different idea. Now, here you're sitting down. I've got my hands isolated in the same position every time. All I'm doing is bringing the handles together, squeezing again for another second between each repetition. And that is just tiring the chest out. It really is training it to its absolute max potential. Bear in mind, guys, we have missed a couple of exercises on triceps that I, we did not film. However, we got this one in, which was the key one. We superseted the rope pull downs and the, I want to say the U bar pull down as well, but I don't know what you're going to call that bar. But anyway, so as you can see here, Harry and Martin were instructing me. What I'm doing is bringing my hands right up, which, yes, it's stretching the tricep out massively. However, coming to the end of the set, I wanted to kind of put a lot more pressure on it. So by going only halfway, it was um, maintaining a lot more pressure on the triceps. So here you can see the tricep pull down with the rope. Again, fully extending and I'm squeezing at the bottom. And I believe we've done 12 to 15 reps per exercise. And we've done three sets for it as well. And now there's just me talking like an idiot. Harry wanted me to film. Harry wanted to be involved. So I thought I'd get him in. See? So again, you got the tricep pull down. Then you superset on to the next movement, which is the rope pull down. 
we'll just wait. There we go. He, he takes his time. So here, the rope pull down again. You can see he's bringing his hands down by his side and he's extending his arms completely. When your arms are fully extended, this engages the tricep to its maximum potential. Right, anyways, so, sorry about that. So the workout's now finished. We've done chest and triceps, absolutely pumped. This is, as you can tell, out there, very, very late. Um, we've got Martin over there, which is right. That guy, that's mine. You will see him in a lot of videos. But as you've noticed, YouTube has had a big change. We've changed the whole channel. It's not Chalk Fitness anymore, it's now my personal one. So yeah, there's a lot of stuff going on. Um, a new website's being made for us. So yeah, that's it. But again, guys, I am sorry that we haven't been around for personal reasons. It's not been easy for us to film constantly. So now we're going to be doing a lot of filming. And just to announce, I will be competing in July this year. So as of Monday, which is in two days, which is, today is Friday, so Monday's, Saturday, Sunday, Monday, I'll be starting my cut. And that's gonna be about for 16 to 20 weeks in that region. So we'll see how we go. Uh, but all the videos, we'll keep you up to date. Um, and as you can tell, we've got another person with me training you have not seen before, but it's this guy here. That one, no, that one, this one, that this one. one. This is Harry, Harry Holcomb. That's Martin, you've seen him before. This is Harry. He's gonna be training with us regularly. But so, apart from that guys, we'll see you in the next episode. Um, yeah, have a good evening, morning, afternoon, lunch, dinner, good night. Valentine's breakfast, whatever you're having. See you later. Good luck.